this is the schematic of a digital clock real-time clock design um, the major components of the system are the uh, the real-time clock here and then the, 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 the PIC which is this um, actually the, P, the, the microcontroller processes the, 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 the I2C data from the real-time clock and then the, the 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 display driver here accepts serial inputs from the microcontroller and then send out parallel um, data that um, controls the the, the 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 lcd segments here and now we can see that the system is running the the initial time is um, is set to zero hours zero minutes and then we can watch as the um, time will progress to the next stage and then once this is achieved and then we can start to set the time using the, the, the input from this place we got um, minutes we got hours plus and we got reset we can reset the time anytime any time so pressing the hours plus button increase the hours and then we can set it to any value let's say uh, let's set it eight and we remember is a 24 hours format display and then we can set it to 15 which is 2 o'clock that we now set it at 14 and also we can set maybe minutes to 15 and we got 14 15 which is um which is 15 PM and then let's achieve that and I think we've achieved it and then we can now around allow the the, the the clock to progress um, accordingly and then And the system can now start all over again. And that is just it. It's an interesting design. What trying out?